In the morning, Peppa came to the bathroom. She had to use the toilet really badly. So she climbed up and began to take a poo. After her poo, Peppa wiped her bum with lots and lots of toilet paper. Then she got down from the toilet and said, Wow, that was a lot of work, but I feel so much better now. Peppa was just about to flush the toilet when the potty police showed up. And the potty police said, You've used way too much toilet paper. This is such a waste. And Peppa said, Really? I never really thought about that. I just wanted to get clean. But the potty police said, You could plug up the toilet and look at the mess you made. I'm writing you a toilet ticket. Then she made Peppa clean up her mess and promise not to use so much toilet paper in the future. A short time later, Spider-Man came by and he said, I gotta go pee so badly. Good thing the Peppa Pig house is on the way to work. I'm sure they won't mind if I use their toilet. And then Spider-Man took a really long pee. After he was done, he said, that was an amazing pee. That's why they call me the Amazing Spider-Man. But then, out of nowhere, the potty police showed up. Then Spider-Man said, Oh, hey there, officer. I hope there's no problems today. I just came by to use Peppa Pig's toilet. And the officer replied, There is a problem. Look at the mess you made. You peed all over the toilet seat and the floor. Then Spider-Man said, Maybe the problem is the toilet. It's in the wrong position or something. But the potty police replied, You made a mess because you were standing too far away from the toilet. I'm issuing you a toilet ticket. Then the potty police got Spider-Man to clean up his mess. In the early afternoon, George came to the bathroom and he said, I just had a really big lunch and now I gotta go poo. So George climbed up on the toilet and began pooping. After he was done, he looked into the toilet bowl and said, Wow, there's so much poop in there. But when George was just about to leave, the potty police showed up. And George said, Oh, hey there, potty police. I didn't make a mess this time, so there's no problems, right? And the officer replied, Well, George, I think you forgot an important step in taking a poo. Uh, what's that, said George. And the officer said, Can you turn around for me? So George slowly turned around. And the officer said, George, you didn't wipe your bum. That's really unclean. And mommy's gonna be upset when she does your laundry. So the potty police gave George a toilet ticket. And made sure he finished wiping his bum. Sometime later, Daddy Pig entered the bathroom. And he said, Oh, my stomach has really been acting up lately. So he climbed up on the toilet and began to take a poo. After he was done, Daddy Pig was just getting ready to flush the toilet when the potty police showed up. And Daddy Pig said, oh, What seems to be the problem, officer? I haven't done anything wrong. And the officer said, Your poop smells bad. <coughs> And you were farting a lot. It's really stinky in here. And Daddy Pig replied, But I'm allowed to do that. I'm in the bathroom. That's true, said the potty police. But you forgot to turn on a fan or open a window. So I'm giving you a ticket for excessive bad smells. And she handed Daddy Pig a toilet ticket. The day was almost over, so the potty police officer thought, Well, 
I guess it's finally my turn to use the toilet. So she climbed up and began to take her pee. After she was done, she gave the toilet a flush, but just as she was about to leave, Peppa Pig showed up. And the officer said, Is there a problem here? Then Peppa reached over, took her hat, and said, You forgot to wash your hands. That's really unclean. And the officer said, Oh my, I guess I did forget to wash my hands. But we all make mistakes, right? And that's why I'm giving you a toilet ticket. And then she took the officer to the sink where she washed her hands.